This screencast video will show you how to use the Loop Database Activity. The Loop Database Activity supports collaborative learning. It allows students to create entries on a certain topic, browse other entries, leave comments and so on. Different databases will have different setups and configurations. In this example, students have the ability to create an entry, browse other entries after they have created their first one, rate the relevance of other entries, and leave comments on other entries. Click to open the database. Click Add Entry. Begin populating your entry according to the fields. If entering a large amount of text, Consider writing it in Google Docs or Microsoft Word first, and then paste it in. Just be mindful that the formatting doesn't go astray. Add tags to your entry by typing a keyword in the tag field and hitting enter on your keyboard. Click Save and View. To browse all other entries in the database, click View List. To view an entry on its own and to leave comments on it, click the More icon, which looks like a magnifying glass. From the Ratings drop down menu, Choose the rating you wish to leave. Click Comments to open the Comments field. Begin typing your comment. Expand the field to allow you more room by clicking the diagonal line icon in the bottom right corner and dragging. Click Save Comment. To search for particular words or entries in the database, click Search. Enter your search term in the relevant field and click Save Settings. The search results now appear on screen. To go back to seeing all the database entries, click Reset Filters to return to the list view.